Hello guys, welcome to the video. In this video, our uh, sponsor for this video is Blocks Hosting uh, for all your Blocks hosting website needs, uh, unlimited SSD storage, first and certificate, free exclusive site load tool, and the ability for a, for a WordPress conversion as well. So I hope you guys enjoy the video coming up and uh, visit Blocks Hosting in the description below. Okay guys, so what's going on? Welcome back to another video. It's been a while since we've done a Blocks tutorial, but in this tutorial, we're gonna go through how to add a tool, a great tool called Hotjar. Basically Hotjar gives you feedback uh, on what's actually going on. It gives you a thing called a page heat map so you can see where people are clicking, where the mouse is spending most of the time on the page. Um, as well as record is pe records people's sessions so you can see where they're scrolling. Uh, I'll give you a little example of what we've got here. So this is my own personal account. Uh, now what we have here is we can have recordings. So this is for blockshosting.com. Um, if we just play one of the recordings you'll see when it loads you can see exactly how the user is spending time on the page um, for example how they scroll um, where they click and it's great for insights and so you can see exactly where people are spending their time okay for so to add a new site what you want to do is just go to add a new site we'll make another one called test.com uh, site type it's just going to be other site owner is going to be me uh, uh, there we go and it will be made as a basic so with the basic plan you get up to 100 page recordings and get quite a large um, uh, site as well um, quite a lot of page recordings which is excellent um, so we just go there there we go w.test.com get the tracking code now we copy that into the head tag on every page where you wish to track visitors and collect feedback Okay, now to implement it into your block site, so you can open up blocks here, create a new project, wait for it to load, and then gonna create a new site, gonna go on to page settings, add custom ho code head and body header, and we just want to paste that in there like that, and then click done. And what that will do is it every page that's exported. Uh, will be tracked using Hotjar pretty much. Um, so there'll be nothing on the page, but if we inspect the page, uh, what you'll see is you'll see head, uh, you'll see Hotjar tracking code, and there it is, there's the Hotjar tracking code, uh, and that'll be basically tracking everything that you, I'm doing on the page right now. There's nothing on the page uh, at the moment, but that's what it will be doing. And uh, yeah, so you'll be able to see exactly what's going on. Um, you can even add IP blocking. Uh, you can add custom user accounts so that other people can uh, view in and have a look at this. Um, you can have a look at some IP blocking, so you could block certain IPs if you put your IP in, which is there. Then it basically means that people um, won't be able to see exactly what you're doing. Um, if we go to that one .com, you'll see there's no active emails at the moment. Um, but we successfully installed the script, which means that it's seen the script, as uh, simple as that. And uh, you can refer people, and yeah. So that's good. Uh, okay, so that's all there is really to it. Um, you'll be able to add different polls. You can add different forms as well. If you add a form, um, you can track certain forms, and then it, you'll see where people are interacting. As you see, this little GIF shows. Um, you can add a little feedback button if you like. Um, where people can rate their experience, which is good, add polls, surveys as well as recruiters, uh, funnels, funnels are basically, there you go, they make make you see where you're losing your visitors, it's pretty interesting as well. Uh, basically it's loads of data that you wouldn't have uh, pretty much unless using Hotjar, and it runs in the background, really really small, um, and you barely notice it's there, it just runs that little bit of code in the background, it's superb. Okay guys, and that's all for today's video, if you want more information on Hotjar, um, just let me know and I'll see how well I can do with helping. And yeah, uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you in another video.